son, when you grow up, you can be anything you want to be. Really, Dad? Like an astronaut? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. More like a librarian. There's really only 13 things you can be. Oh. All right, trades, now. Uh, I got Painter Barthor Pods for 15 emeralds. <laughs> Say that silly shit again. All right, I got Mending for two emeralds. Yeah, that's more like it. Get in the boat. Dad, do you know this guy? Son, it'll be okay. Protect your mother. Dad? Dad? This is where my hatred of players began. I was too weak to save him back then, but I promised myself I would never be too weak again. I started training every single day, honing my skills and abilities, and then I sought out on a journey to find my father. I searched, and I searched, but it just looked more and more hopeless as days went on. I began to resent the useless villagers who did nothing as my father was taken from me but stand back and watch, and as my hatred grew, I felt myself begin to change. I continued my search for my father as I swore one day I would free him, and as fate would have it, on one random day, I finally found him. The man who took everything from me. Hello? My dog! Do you know who I am? I've never seen you before in my life. Oh. Oh, stop, 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 I'm really low. When I was a kid, you took my father from me. He was a librarian. Where is he? Uh, maybe in my villager farm, I think? Villager I farm? In a fit of rage, I killed him. Villager farm? What a disgusting term, as if we're some kind of livestock. What I found horrified me. Tens of hundreds of villagers ripped from their towns and families, forced to serve this greedy player. I hadn't seen my father anywhere on the farm, so I anxiously entered the final building. Oh my god, Dad, I finally found you! Son, is that you? You look so different. Yeah, I've been looking for you for 10 years. I can finally break you out of here. Let's go. Wait, son, I don't want to go. What do you mean you don't want to go? We, we can be a family again. We can start making up for lost time. Lost time? I'm exactly where I want to be. Being taken is the highest honor a villager can receive. I wouldn't change anything even if I could. This is how villager society is meant to be. Well, if this is how villager society is meant to be, then I'll form my own society. And we'll start tearing down villager society, starting with my own father. What do you mean, son? I just wanted to be an astronaut. So I formed my own society. I may start small, but over time I'm gonna build something that can reshape this world into a better one. I think this is gonna be the end of me. <gasps> a campfire! I'm saved! Oh my god, sir, I'm so sorry to be a bother, but I'm starving. I've been lost in the woods for days. Do you have any food? Oh, of course. Uh, here, take some bread. Oh my god, thank you. Oh, and here's a health potion. Oh my god, a health pot. You're, you're a saint. Thank you so much. Wait, whoa. What was in that health pot? <laughs> I'm sorry, but I need you to help fix my brother. But your, your brother? What? You... Whoa, what the hell is this thing? Wait, where are you going? As days passed, the situation looked helpless for the adventurer, until he was visited by a strange man. Oh my god, sir, I don't know who you are, but you gotta get me out of here now. This guy is crazy. He's been running all these tests on me, and I think he's trying to bring his brother back to life. Calm down, kid. I'm a WTA agent. We've known about this guy and his experiments for months. I'm getting you out of here. Oh my god, thank you so much. Before we go, I need to blow up this research. It's glad it's horrific. <laughs> I knew the WTA was investigating me. You people do such sloppy work. Fortunately, you both will not be leaving here alive. Shit! There's no time, kid. I'm sorry. This place needs to be destroyed. Do it. Wait! No! No, wait! Stop! Please! You'll kill us! And so, the lab was destroyed, along with all the research. The explosion at the lab left just one survivor. But for now, this story turns its lens to a normal village blacksmith. I'm just a normal villager. Let me walk you through my day. I wake up at sunrise every morning, and I start doing what I do best, blacksmithing. My trades are axes, pickaxes, and chest plates. And I love what I do because I'm the best at it. Around 2 p.m. is when the players start arriving, and I stay extremely busy because my prices are fair and my work is excellent. Yo, man, can you repair my iron sword for me? I damaged it during my last adventure. Aw, oh, man, I wish I could, but I'm just so swamped right now. Is there anybody else you can ask? No, nah, man, it has to be you. You always make the best stuff. All right, I think I can squeeze you into my schedule. Just give me the sword and try and come back the same time tomorrow. Yo, let's go, man. So as you can tell, I had a pretty nice life in the village. That was until that day. Help me, help me! Whoa, what the heck? Why did you kill him? 
Someone like you would never understand, but these players are not our friends. I've seen the evil their greed leads to, and I'm freeing this world one village at a time. Sir, all the players in this town have been killed. Should we move on to the next? Nice work. Let's move out. I couldn't understand why he said the things he said. I spent my whole life in this village, living in peace and harmony with the players. They weren't our enemies, but our friends. I knew he had to be stopped, so I went and did what I do best, blacksmithing. As you all know, this village is under my control now. This means I will kill any player that tries to come to this town. This banner is a symbol, but more than that, it is a promise that I will not let a player hurt a villager ever again. From this day forward, players are no longer welcome here. You need to leave this town, now. Are these statues supposed to intimidate me? I'll give you one chance to leave peacefully. Ha! You must be out of your mind. You there, kill him for me. What? They can move! Leave here and never return, or I'll kill you. You're gonna wish you didn't do this. And so, the blacksmith removed the pillagers from the village. But for how long? Headquarters is only a few hours away. We just need to keep moving. Look, sir. A campfire. Maybe we should set up camp? Hmm. It is getting late. Let's go check it out. Uh, sir, you might want to see this. What is it? Help! Oh, just a filthy player? I'll put him out of his misery. No, wait. Do you have any potions of health? Ha! Huh. Why would I waste any of my health potions on a filthy player like you? Oh, well, it doesn't even matter at this point. All my research on body modification, it's all gone. And my brother, he's dead. Body modification? Wait a second. We're bringing him with us. What? This chance encounter would lead to the creation of something that should never have existed. Open the door. Ah, hello there. I heard you had something to show me. Ah, yes. Welcome. I think you will find that your research money did not go to waste here. Oh, that's what I love to hear. Wait, what's this guy's deal? Yes, he may look like one of us, but he's actually been leaking information to the WTA. What? That traitor! Please, <laughs> yes. don't do this! I have a family! I was one of you guys! Drop him. And now watch. Oh my god! It's magnificent! What do you call it? <laughs> yes, my masterpiece. I call it the Ravager. This is exactly what we needed to change the tides. Look, they're setting up the celebration for you. Yeah, uh, yeah, I guess it looks fun. What's wrong? You're the hero of the village. Uh, it's just, ever since that day, I've, I've had a bad omen. What, what was that sound? What the hell is that? Kill them all, but save the blacksmith for me. There you are. This is madness. You'll get everybody killed. If that's what it takes. <laughs> you had your chance to join me, and you chased me out with those iron golems. So I've returned with a beast of my own. I think you'll find they're quite powerful. What are these things? Some more people who were foolish enough to cross me. I've had them genetically modified, and now they're my ultimate weapon. These used to be people? You truly are sick! Sir, the enemy forces are retreating. They've been overpowered by your golems. We've won. I suppose I'll kill you another time. Sir, what happened? I heard about the loss. <laughs> that was no loss. I got exactly what I went for.